What about the walk-offs? You know, guys going against each other in a competitive fashion on the runway. I hear it goes on, you know, in an underground scene. No, not really. Not really. It's uh, just a gossip. So you're saying the first rule of walk-offs is not to talk about walk-offs? No, don't talk about it. Better. I think that's definitely more of an underground thing. New York sewers is a big place for uh, people to host it, so I've never gone to one myself, but uh, I hear they're pretty brutal, actually. The loser usually just gets killed right there and then, so... So they actually exist? They do. I mean, usually if, if a model hasn't been seen for a while, he's probably dead in the New York sewers because his walk wasn't good enough. What about the facial expression? Because I'm so into the like the pouting, the blue steel face. Like, can you give us your version of that? What does it look like? I'd have to be on the runway to show you. I don't know. It's just. <laughs> but is it like it's a cheek thing or is it a lip pout? Because it's very complex to me. I don't get it. Uh, I think it's a pretty simple expression. No expression really. Maybe a lack of expression. Maybe that's stoicism. Maybe, yeah. Most shows don't really want you to look uh, like happy or smiling for some reason. A few do, but uh, most don't. But uh, I don't think anyone really takes it that seriously when it comes to posing. But do you do like cheek exercises? Like, cheek I don't know, like sort of chin ups? Chin ups with your cheeks? Yeah. Cheek ups? Cheek ups. No, um, not really, not myself. I mean, some of the other guys might. We used to do that, yeah. We used to do that a lot at the shoots. Always, like, in the end, we used to do um, a group shot with all the models doing, like, you know, these kind of funny shots. But uh, I think the stuff is out a little bit, you know. Now it's more super coolness, the Zoolander, because the movie is a little bit older now, so the zooing is out, you know. <laughs> what is your go-to strut? Are you, like, a galloper or are you a heel-toe guy? Gallop, um, that's a good idea, yeah. Just a little horsey kick at the end or something, yeah. I'd say in between like a canter and a gallop, but also I imagine a horse, a horse that's been like injured in the knee and it's, uh, its owner wants to put it down because, you know, it's not going to be able to race anymore. But it's just trying, you know, it's trying to like not show everyone it's hurt its leg. That's usually like my inspiration when I'm walking, yeah. But it seems like it's straight swagger. It's like fighting through the pain. Definitely, yeah. It's like swagger, but inside, like you're crying.